Hey Ross World, today we will be reviewing another set of headphones. Now if you looked at my other video, those headphones or rather those earphones had the clips around the ears. Now these use a sort of a flange that goes inside your ear, but let's get into the review. These are called the Leaf Ear Wireless Earphones. So let me give you just what they have stated on Amazon. The Leaf Ear Wireless Bluetooth Earphones with a mic, sweatproof earbuds, best for listening to music, running at the gym, and they also contain passive noise cancellation. They claim that they have stereo sound quality. Now, here are some of the specs in layman's terms, I would like to say, and then we get into some details. They have true, high definition, high fidelity sound featuring the latest Bluetooth 4.1 CSR technology and state-of-the-art acoustic components that produce incredible sound quality with deep bass and crystal clear trouble. Comfortable and secure fit, active buzz featuring ergonomically designed flexible ear hooks. Now, when they say ear hooks, they don't hook around your ear, it's more inside of the flange of your ear. With the gel flex silicone earbuds to ensure your headphones stay comfortably, firm in place to guarantee fatigue-free ears and tangle-free comfort. Now, if you notice all the new headphones come with this really flat cord here, that's basically the tangle free ones. Now they claim the longest battery life, the new and improved lithium polymer battery allows seamless enjoyment of music for up to eight hours and 240 hours standby with a quick charge of only 1.5 hours. So basically you can listen to it for about eight hours, standby 240, and it only takes an hour and a half to charge. Now the Bluetooth technology, of course, wireless, and they also have noise suppression technology. And you can listen to this up 30 feet away from the device that you're actually being Bluetooth from. Now this item is, is on Amazon, listed for $29.99, that's $30, okay? And they have really good reviews, you wanna go through that, so on and so forth. All right, they have about 4.8 stars. Now, without further ado, here's the box. Nothing special about this. It's claiming eight hours of battery life, okay? Going around here. Now, you see at the top, he has your features, 4.1, high definition, sports friendly, extra bass, hands-free call, and lightweight. We'll get into that whole extra bass piece. And here are the specs that some of you guys really wanna know. The battery capacitor, the battery type, the standby time, charging time, the ohms, the watts, the kilohertz, and also the sensitivity to sound, okay? Then they have their slogan here, they have the little writing, yada, 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 and big in red, they have that they have one year warranty on these headphones. Here are the three different colors, you have black on black, black on blue, and black on like a deep green, forest green. So without further ado, let's pop this thing open, okay? Nothing special about the box, but already, Good presentation with a case. A lot of us has all these, you know, earbuds that don't have a case. Now, felt around here, which, you know, this is statics. And you have your usual books that, hey, we won't get into, but here's a quick glance, okay? All the little key codes. All right, let's get that out the way. Now, here's the case. It's kind of a hard case, that's pretty good. Okay, all right, just a little test there. Nothing special about it. Let's zip it up and see what we have. All right, we got some cords here. That's your charging cord, micro USB to USB. We have your different fittings right here. Here's your little flange. We'll get into those. And last but not least, we have your actual earphones, okay? So here's a case. You have a little pocket here. Put your wires and stuff, and it's hard, which is actually great. So if this is in a book bag or you sit on them, they will not break the headphones. Now, these are not super hard, but they are hard enough to protect them. All right. Here we go. So... Here's a flange here that already hooks inside of your ear. And of course, I went over these that we'll get into. All right, you got the flat cable. So let me untangle these and I'll get back to you guys. Now, these are Bluetooth. And as you can tell, you have a cincher here that's gonna cinch the wire down, loosen it up, depending on how big your head is, right? 
or you can tighten it up. That's actually a good feature. I like that. Okay. It moves when you want it to move because once again, these are Bluetooth. They go around your head, right behind your back, behind your neck, or dangling in the front, however you want it. So let's take a quick look here. All right. Silicone earpieces here that goes inside your ear. Then also these flanges here. Just giving a quick look over. Let's look at this one. All right. I turned them on somehow. Look at that. Good design here. You can tell you see the play and you see the answer call button right here. And yes, that's a button. Look around here. You also have the volume down and the volume up button on this particular hair. This must be the, the head piece of this whole piece. So this might just be the follower. And nope, that's not a button. And no, so this is the main piece you're gonna do everything for. And as you can tell, somehow I turned it on and now it's trying to Bluetooth. So I'm gonna Bluetooth these to my phone and see where we go from there. All right, also to note here, guys, if you're looking for the charging piece, self-explanatory. So now I'm gonna play some music, throw these in my ear, tell you how they feel and how they actually sound. So now that I'm having my ear, I'm just doing a quick sound test. Now, excuse me if I'm talking loudly, but I have it turned all the way up. The bass is actually deep as they're claiming. Now, as a disclaimer, as a disclosure, these headphones came, earphones came totally free from the manufacturer. So I'm giving my unbiased opinion because it's free. Hey, who cares, right? But I do want them to send me more stuff if it sounds as good as this. this. So I'm going to turn it up a little bit. Wow. They're pretty loud. The loudness, I, it's run out all the sound around me. Shake test. So this one is going to eventually fall off because I always have issues with my left ear. Now, you know some of you got some problem ears. My left one, this came with the stock flangey pieces. So let me turn this down. These are pretty loud, pretty deep bass. Now, I don't know if they have an app. I'll have to research the app. But I can tell you right now, these are quality earbuds for around $29.99. That's $30. Very deep bass. Now, the only issue I have with them, they can be slightly clear. The trouble in the, in the actual earbuds need to be turned up slightly a bit. So if you get these particular earbuds, which I believe is a good buy already, just because of the price, the way they fit, and the actual design of them, okay? Now, this will give you a better look at this. This is how it looks from the back, right? And you just put these in your ear and you make sure the flange piece goes down and it fits right in there, okay? So if you want a closer look, that's how that looks, okay? This is how it is from the front and also this ear. So you have this flange piece right here that curls inside your ear orifice right here and fits and snug. Now, once again, these are the stock ones that actually came with it. But for you guys with smaller ear holes, um, bigger ear holes, they have all these particular pieces. So I'll just give you, just in case you're thinking about buying them, I'll let you see them. And here it is, okay? So if you have big openings, you have that big one here. And if you have small openings, you have that one as well, okay? So as far as the design, I like the design. Usually I get ones that clip my ear because I always have earbuds when I'm in a gym falling out of my ears. It, it's, it's annoying. I can't even get in a good set. I can't even really do what I'm, even if I'm doing just some sort of activity and I want earphones, they always fall out. So now that I have both earphones in, I did a slightly sh shake test before. I'm gonna do a really good shake test now to give you a good depiction, a good picture of how these look in your ear and also while you're working out, doing whatever, you're doing circuit training, you're doing CrossFit, whatever, okay? Make sure they're snug. Make sure the flange piece is here. I'll come close for you to see later. So shake test. All right, this one fell out. Now, before I even, let me really snug this in to give it a fair, a fair go. All right. It's in there. Shake test. Yeah. Rock band. Hey, hey. Hey, not coming out, right? Now, I know some of you do CrossFit, you do circuit training. I'm gonna do a few burpees to see if they come out. Nope. 
they're not coming out, all right? So as you can tell how these look in your ear, you have this piece that you can tighten it up or loosen it up, okay? The right earbud is the one that controls it all. Now, the only thing, let me speak, I'm gonna take them off. The only thing I do not like about, it doesn't tell you which one is the left or the right one. The only thing I can tell you is, the right one is the one with all the electronics, the minus, the plus, the Bluetooth, button pause, answer calls, so on and so forth. So this to recall the two things that I really don't like about these headphones, which is really not that much. The trouble can be turned up just a little bit to make it crystal clear, but I think because maybe the noise counseling technology, no excuse, right? Bose can do it. But these are $30 pair earbuds, Bluetooth earbuds, okay? And for the price, these are these are these are a 10, okay? These are a 10. Now, of course, if you're saying, well, how can they be a 10? Now, when it, when you factor in the price, if these were 50, then I'll say no, these are around an eight. But since they are 30, they fit perfectly. You get extra pieces, okay? You get extra pieces in case they do not fit your ear. And also, another plus is the hard case that you get with these earbuds that's, like I said, semi-hard. You have the logo and brand here, and you also have the felt inside with a netted pocket for you to fit these earphones in. So these, these are actual 10 in my book. Now, other than labeling which one is left and which one is right, let me get a, a fair look over just to make sure. And no. Yep, hold up, they are labeled, excuse me. So this one is the right one. Inside, the, the silicone piece here has an R, and inside of this piece, it has an L. So I really had to look for that. They could have printed it right here, plain and simple. They could have did some sort of a, a plastic metal piece or just melt the plastic and put an L or R in. That was really hard to find. So other than that, the trouble and the labeling, these are major 10. I would advise you getting them. I'll leave the link in the description. And once again, these were free to get my unbiased opinion. And let me tell you, I'm glad they sent it to me. These are a major win. Thank you. This is Ross World. I'm out. Hey.